This video went absolutely bananas on YouTube a few days ago. I've got 5 plus million views at this point, I think. So I decided I make a quick video to show you how you can convert any picture to the very same style that you see here and some other different styles. Also, I'm going to share a third party tool that I often use that will allow you to create different drawings similar to this one or many other more. The first step is to head over to harkish.online. You have to have a Twitch account and you must follow Harkish um, on Twitch. You are presented with this page. All you have to do is click upload image, select whichever image you want to convert, open it up. You've got different style. We are interested in the spiral one. So select this one to start with. Click generate preview. Give it a second. The process is happening in the background on the server. And in three, two, one, go. There we go. It's that simple. And then, of course, you can download the, the PNG here, which should be pretty high resolution. Yes. Or you can download the SVG and you can open it up with your favorite SVG software. I use uh, Inkscape. It's a free and it, it does the job for what I need to do. And there it is. So if you click, if you select the node tool and you click on the path, you can see the individual nodes. There's a bunch of them. There we go. Of course, you can also select vertical lines and this will create a bunch of vertical lines with the squiggles and then the traditional one. I call it traditional because it's the first one I've ever made. It's called uh, horizontal lines. Same concept, but the lines are running across rather than up and down. There it is. Now, these are my tools that are available on my website. Again, you must follow Harkish on Twitch. Or if you want to use another software that you can have on your computer, just head on to Marginally Clever Michelangelo Software. Link in the description down below. Um, it's a little tricky to find where it is. So that is the GitHub page. You have to head over to Releases. Click on Releases. Scroll all the way down until you find Nightly Builds. Click on there. And if you're on Windows, you have to, don you have to download the Michelangelo Windows.msi. Once you have that, you open the software. It's presented like this. And all you have to do is File, Open File, select any picture you want, really. Click Open. And in a few seconds, you should see. Huh, there we go. Ain't that cool? And here you have a bunch of different styles you can select from with many, many options. Uh, boxy, you have my crosshatch. Oh, by the way, I, I'm in touch with the guy who develops this software. Great guy. He's just constantly updating it, adding new features. And uh, yeah, he's very receptive to feedbacks from the community. So yeah, that is a fantastic tool, guys, you can use. And if you go back to the pulsing spiral here, which is similar to the one that I do. You have a bunch of parameters that you can mess around with. Spirals to corners is my favorite one because I have not developed this system yet on my script. So well done, Dan. And there it is. And of course, once you are happy with the result, you can close that window. You go file, save file, and you can select a bunch of formats, including G code, Scalable SVG, TIFF, PNG, and so on and so forth. That's it. I hope that helps. So yeah. Yeah, that might take a little while to, to, to do. I freak. I smashed my knee onto my other knee.